guys, welcome to Free Game Friday. Today we're going to be looking at this game right here called Soar. We're going to see if it's worth the time and space on your system. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Well, actually, before we get started, if you like this video, make sure to go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you don't like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Now, let's get into it. Alright, so we have a warning. To have a full game experience, please use your headphones and switch to full screen mode. The following game is not recommended for children. Pregnant women. Pregnant women? What's wrong with pregnant women? Why can't they play this game? It's kind of messed up. Alright, let's see. To come in, to come out. I want to come out. No, let's see. Let's go. Alright, ashes are everywhere, and dust is so cruel, he does not see a grain, keeping the idea like a doll, like a fool, he follows the road off me. I probably said that wrong. Let's see. Alright, and I moved the mouse around, but nothing's happening. Alright, so, oh, looks like the WASD is going to be doing it. Alright. So, first impression looks pretty cool. Obviously, a little bit game. We have something hanging and dripping right over here. Oh, let's see. Oh, I'm trying to use the mouse right here. Enter, okay. Information, a hanged man. Oh, shoot, that's a man. A hanged man probably, he didn't feel very comfortable here. Examine the body? Yes. There are no obvious traces. Oh, there are no, what? There are no obvious traces of beating on the body. There is nothing useful in the pockets, only urine dripping down his legs. Lovely. Apparently, he has hanged himself relatively recently. I wonder who this who is this poor fellow. Hmm. I wonder. You should be wondering who he is. I'm just, oh, all right. So we got a little five on the wall. Oh, enter. A poster on the wall. I see the number five on it. Very observant. TV. All right. Yellow due to his age. Two TV. Record three, four, two. The number three is crossed out. Turn on TV. Let's do it. I love watching some telly. Ah, oh, my favorite show. All right, forty-two. Let's see this. A poster on the wall. I see the number four or two on it. There's definitely something behind it. Take it down. What the fuck? What is this? A key? <gasps> this is a key. Take the key. Yes. All right. Oh, that's a little interesting sound. All right, so now what? Do 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 do. Already did that. Oh, dead. Dead. Come on, bed. Oh, oh, there we go. A bed. There's nothing on nor under it. Only a torn mattress and springs sticking out of the holes. That sounds comfortable. All right. That's why you do memory foam. Oh, is that a toilet? I think that's a toilet. A toilet. Yes. Fortunately, I do not feel the smell. I don't think many people feel the smell either. It must be sinking badly. How do you know? I'll flush it anyways. Just be polite. You always flush after. So, it is, oh, there we go. Information, there's a small gap in the door. Look through it. Yes. What is that? Watchman. So, a bodyguard, I guess? Not bodyguard. Like a security guard. Do you remember how long we've been here? So is this like a prison? I'm getting the sense this is like a, a prison. Um, let's try this. Are you dreaming? What are your dreams about? I don't know why I keep talking to you. You don't answer me anyway. <laughs> but gosh, it makes me calm. You know, you probably wouldn't be calm if you knew why he wasn't talking. I'm sorry and I apologize. I mean the same thing, except at a funeral. <laughs> That's a, I'm gonna have to remember that. That one's funny. Okay, let's, keep, let's do another one. What's the meaning of life, universe, and everything? I don't know. Is he gonna answer? Some people just need to hug around the, around the neck with the rope. <laughs> Alright, so I don't think I'm gonna get anything useful from him. Alright, so. Oh, oh. That might be important. It's just a stool. That's it. Dang. Shut me down. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait. Information, the door is locked. Firmly locked. Not loosely locked. There are three locks, and each one has a picture engraved on it. An axe, a lion, 
in a scarecrow. Use the key? Yeah. The key successfully turned in the keyhole. The lock with the picture. The X is open. Sweet. Alright, let's see if we can find another key. Oh, oh, oh. How did I not see that? A uh, dilapidated old nightstand. Dilapidated? It seems to be unlocked. Alright, open it. Let's do this. Information, there's a crumbled note inside. Ooh, it's probably a suicide letter. The idea. The idea was the meaning of his life. The idea was that very... Was that very hope for life? The idea was that very hope for life. That doesn't sound grammatically correct. The idea made him crazy. The idea became a purpose. Not his life. Everything that surrounded him became insipid. I need to look that up. Inessential and finally meaningless. The only connection with an outer world was his own torturer who didn't let him out, held him, broke him, gave him false hope, so he's been tortured. Interesting. You didn't find an exit, and you. Will you find it? Wait, so. Was this like left over for the hanging guy, or. Was this from the hanging guy written to his ghost? I don't know. But apparently, they're obviously being held against their will, and there's a torturer, so maybe not a prison. Maybe they've been like kidnapped or something. Alright, a cool breeze is blowing through, and it's raining. Will it ever end? I don't know, man. I don't know. Alright, so let's see. These little sketchy marky thingies on the wall. Probably him keeping track of time was at 5 in each one. 5, 5, 5, 5, 5. So 25. I guess he was here 25 days or something. That's another number. Number seem pretty important. So you got like a 4, 2, and then a 3, 4, 2 with the 3 crossed out, and a 5, and 5 times 5, and 25. A lot of numbers. I just wish there was something I could do with them. Um, nothing. Alright, so now what? Let's see, I already did the bed. I can't get out anywhere. Oh! 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 You see that? Oh! 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 Hey! <laughs> I'm, trying to, I'm trying to hit it at the moment that it's blinking. Ah, oh, come on. There we go, sweet. A brick, I think. It can be pushed. Push it. Oh, Eureka! He struck gold. I mean, well, key in this case. Take key. Yeah. So we take one key and then like eight disappear. Another key. This is a key. Take it. Let's take it over to the door. This has the two keys. The door is locked firmly. Use a key. Key successfully turned the keyhole. The lock with the picture of the lion is opened. Sweet! Let's do the other one! The door is locked, firmly locked. There are okay, use key. The key doesn't move and the keyhole obviously doesn't fit. Oh. Oh shoot, what's happening? What's going on? The ground is shaking. The music's changing. Oh shoot! What's that sound? What are you there? Oh, that's kind of creepy. So was that? Is he still there? Oh, look at that! Like in the top right of his room, it says "coda." Coda sounds a little bit like the word "code." Um. I want to peacefully my seat like my, my grandfather not streaming and yelling like the passengers in his car. <laughs> okay, so what what was that all about? Alright, so in his room there's Coda, C O D A, and a clock, and then three holes in the wall. But I don't understand what I need to do. Hmm. Will this mystery be solved? How long have we been here? 25 days, apparently. 
since you started to rain, my wife can't stop looking through the window. If it will start pouring down, I'm afraid I will have to let her inside. It doesn't make any sense, but okay. Uh, this TV isn't really helping. It's shining a light on my ghost, though. It's like changing the color. I wonder if that's significant at all. Probably not. Thunder a little scary. Scurry. Alright, so what's that last key for then? Why didn't it work? Is there something else that it unlocks? No. It's nothing there. Maybe if I flush the toilet again, it might pop out a new key or something. Hello? Fleming's here. I'm not even able to flush the toilet now. Yeah, the number five. Dang. Coming to a standstill now. Oh, oh, we already did that. Never mind. Ah, okay. No obvious traces of beating on the body. There is nothing useful. So this guy wasn't tortured. Uh, there has to be something to do with the guy on the other side. Alright, there's a clock. Clicking thing. Or is that number one? But what do the numbers mean? What do we even do with the numbers? I still understand, man. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, I. Uh. Hey dad, how do you feel about abortion? Ask your sister. I don't have that's messed up, man. Ah. Is this brick gonna do anything again? Let's try again. A brick, I think we push. I wonder if I have to like push it in a certain order or something. So number three is crossed out, so I'm not gonna do three. How about I push it three times? This is probably just completely not get right. So I'm gonna say no. So I push it four times, and now I'm gonna push it two times. If I can push it, All right? Push it. Push it. Push it real good. All right, and then the second time. And then I'll push it, or not push it, so that was two. And now I'll push it five times. And if that doesn't work, then I have no idea what I'm doing with my life. Well, I mean, I already have no idea what I'm doing with my life. Alright, so that's two. Let's do it again. The TP is kind of annoying me a little bit. Alright, so that's three. Let's do it again. Four. Was that four? Five? And nothing's happening. Oh well. Alright, so let's turn it off. Off. Then on. Then off. Then on. Turn it off. That's not doing anything. All right. Well, I think that's it. I'm coming to a standstill. I have no idea what this is about. What I'm supposed to do after this? It was kind of interesting, kind of putting the pieces together of what happened here. But it's really not that interesting. I mean, I mean, kinda. But now it's kind of getting a little bit boring. So I don't know if if you want to take this challenge up and see if you can figure out what the heck is going on, then by all means, go ahead. But me personally, uh, what the fuck language? Paikin? What is that?
I don't know. Anyways, that's going to be the end of this episode. Hopefully, they brought some insight, and you can make a decision whether you think it's worth the space on your computer or not. All right, peace.